Hey guys, it's Nicola with your daily reads for July 16th, 2018. These are general readings, guys. If you would like to purchase a personal reading for me, you can hit me up on my email, intimatewisdomtarot at gmail.com. You can also hit me up on my website, www.intimatewisdom.net to check out all the other services I offer. You can hit me up on Instant Go for instant access to me 24 hours a day. You can type that into your search bar, www.instantgo.com slash intimate wisdom get to me. You can also download that on your app store for my iPhone iOS users. For my returning subscribers, hey, how y'all doing? If you are new to my channel, please make sure you hit that red subscribe button. Make sure you hit the red bell on, is it red? Hit the damn bell on the side so you can get notified every time I do uh, new reads. Other than that, that's all I got. Enjoy your read. Hey. So we're working on Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, July 16th. What messages do we have for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius? Sun, Moon, and Rising, July 15th, 2018. What messages do we have for my Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius? Sun, Moon, and Rising, July 16th, 2018. Y'all all over the place. Keep looking at that Knight of Wands. Somebody's moving very impulsively, saying some very impulsive stuff too. Queen of Swords on there. Somebody is being very vocal <laughs> about what it is that they desire. They feel alone, feel left out, feel um, imbalanced in some way, shape, or form. You have an opportunity. I'm not gonna say you have an opportunity, but whatever you're doing now, you really have the Midas touch. But things could be moving kind of fast, so you may be feeling either a lack, um, disconnected a little bit with yourself, um, physically disconnected with yourself a little bit. But your manifestations are taking form. So whatever you've been desiring, wishing for, speaking for, this wand here is like you waved your magic wand and it's on and popping. So right now, this could be you just not speaking your truths, but maybe um, making decisions, uh, being confident about those decisions, okay? With the Magician card, this is definitely some good things popping off. Some of you guys can be done with the Sagittarius, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo here, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Somebody could be coming in very quickly offering some... Um, affection physical affection but it's causing some type of imbalance so maybe this person that's coming in there's some conflict around the situation um could be a capricorn that's coming in offering something very impulsive very um fast moving energy eight of wands knight of wands you're getting what you asked for now three of cups could be sex could be happiness could be just going out partying all right, so let's clarify this Five of Pentacles. Let's see what's going on up here. What's going on with this Five of Pentacles? Gemini, Libra, Paris, Sun, and Rising. Why is this Five of Pentacles here? And this could be um, issues with money. Yeah, someone needs some assistance. Someone's burden um, in regards to some money. So someone may be manifesting some resources because you're having issues with money. Um, asking for some assistance with the six of pentacles reaching out that some people call that the beggar card but i don't think that's the beggar card i think that's the card of saying it's okay to ask for assistance and you'd be surprised who might be there to help you with the nine of wands you got some energy coming in very fast so this could also be um you needed to make a decision about maybe um bills very fast maybe you like which bill do i need to pay right now um trying to manifest some new resources some of you guys are waking up some choices, okay? You need to make some decisions. You need to look at some situation and make a clear, concise decision. Because there's a lot of things coming at you. And it may have you off balance. So now you're asking, okay, you may have a lot of burdens, okay? That is making you feel like you have to do everything alone. So right now you're needing to find the confidence and ask for some assistance. Look, fucking help me, okay? I got a lot going on. You see, I got a lot going on. Help me. This can be in your life, in your job. Um, you're, and you're, you have the power to manifest what you need, so ask for it, okay? Let's see why this magician is here. Why is this magician here? Why is this magician here? Hey, man. Some of you guys are, like, waiting either <laughs> for... It's like you're waiting. What are you waiting for? Why is this hanging in here? You can't don't don't be waiting around. I feel like it's not time. Not time for you to shine. Not time. Mmm, I get it. Okay, ask for some assistance. 
you're going to receive some assistance. Some of you guys are manifesting something bigger. It's not time, okay? There's still something that needs to be, um, there's some illumination that needs to happen. Something within your thought process. You may be doing some things impulsively um, out of a codependency. So this money situation may be just a codependent, okay? Something may be moving very fast. You may not be actually seeing um, the resources or seeing your ability to complete a task or get some things done. So you may be making impulsive decisions and not allowing situations to unfold how they should. So it's causing a lot of worry. Spirit is telling you to wait and watch your manifestations take place. A lot of you guys are putting these manifestations into um, the universe and afraid of the outcome <laughs> is what I'm getting. So let's see what guidance we have. What guidance do we have for my air signs? It's going to fall in place. Literally, let me tell you what just happened. One of my cards literally flew out my hand, jumped into the air, and flew back in the middle of my deck right in place. So whatever you're dealing with, whatever you're questioning about, it is going to fall right into place. Let go of your, your restraint on it. Let go of your control of the situation and watch it take form. What messages do we have for my Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius? July 16th, 2018. Messages for my Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Sun, Moon, and Rising. July 16th. That's your title. Everything will fall in place. That's your title. You're very sensitive right now, so that, that is an issue. I'm glad nobody reads this but me. Ah, like, what the fuck is she writing? All right. I'm trying to tell you everything going to fall in place. But some of you guys may be um, having issues because there has been some movement in, and out, in or out of your home. Um, you could be now taking on more responsibility, more finances. This is why there's a lot of burdens. Some of you guys are needing to reach out and ask for help. Have some compassion with yourself. Release judgments about yourself, okay? Understand that everything is happening is happening for a reason, okay? It says release judgments about yourself and others and focus on the light and love that is within everyone. When you bring that positivity into your life, it'll change your life. Stop harboring on the negative. Bring peace to your life. Your underlying energy literally says there is no need to worry as everything is working out beautifully. Your household is situation has improved. Point blank period. Okay, that's all I got, y'all. Good night.